Hello guys, we have simulated the different functions from the string library like str alien function is there to ca calculate the length of the string, then str cpy function is there to copy the string, then str cat function for concatenation and str cmp function for comparison. So for all these four functions, we have written our own functions. That means we have simulated them. Now when we have written the definitions of those functions, we have made use of the array notation. So like sometimes it, what happens like when you have been asked to write these function definitions it is mentioned in the question that use pointer notation when you write the definitions or make use of making use of pointer you write these functions so in that case what will be the change in that case only change will be instead of using this array notation you will make use of pointer notation now what is array notation and what is pointer notation so so if you go to the video of my 1d array then in that video I told you that there are two types of notation subscript notation and pointer notation subscript notation is called as array notation so there I have given you one formula where uh, if AR of I is the subscript notation then corresponding pointer notation will be asterisk inside parenthesis ARR plus I so if you are not aware of this subscript notation and pointer notation then you can go back to that video and you go through that video so for your convenience I have pasted the link of that video in the description area so right now I have used this subscript notation here but if I want to implement the same function using pointer then instead of subscript I will go for the pointer notation and that will be the change so here the string length is the function name and in the definition what 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 I will do instead of writing str of i here I will say asterisk inside parenthesis str plus i so that's it now now it has become a uh, definition of the function string length using pointer so now let me compile and run str alien underscore demo dot c is the file so gcc str alien demo underscore c uh, you can just overlook that warning when I run this enter some string if I enter my name say Tushar then length of the string is 6 that means still the function definition is working so let's try this out for some other function suppose for string copy function this is the string copy function def string copy function definition in this definition wherever I have used subscript notation for both the arrays source and destinations I will I will go for the pointer notation that means here instead of S here instead of S SRC of I I will write asterisk inside bracket SRC plus i here also dst of i asterisk inside parenthesis dst plus i then here also it will be asterisk inside bracket src plus i same thing i will copy this line here and now this will be the definition of string copy function using pointer notation so now let me compile and run this strcpy underscore demo dot c so gcc strcpy underscore demo dot c enter source string suppose I enter my full name Tushar Kali then the copied string is Tushar Kali so this copy is happening that means only that thing you will change instead of subscript notation you will go for the pointer notation and now the function is implemented using pointer so same thing you can follow for the string cat function and string compare function so that's it so this was about the simulation of the string library functions using pointers thank you so much for watching the video and please do subscribe